That's the bike for this week. Can I ask you? I don't know if we can tell yet. Oh, okay. You can get about the numbers. Oh. So, <laughs> 1,274 is the amount of days since I last raced. And then 27.5 is is a general uh, number, or 27.5 million is how many people would have died around the world due to cancer in 1,274 days. So, you know, if you think, I mean, that's really an insignificant number, but it leads to that number, which is a very significant number. If you think about that, 27.5 million people in a, in a relatively short amount of time is, you know, if that were to happen in Darfur or Sierra Leone, the world, the entire world would be uh, at war for that. So, you know, it's something to just put things in perspective and get us thinking about that on a global perspective. Puts it in perspective, there's more people, there's other cases, there's less people living in Australia. 20 million, how many are in Australia? 20, 20, 20 million? Yeah. Yeah, so you can imagine in three and a half years you're having an entire country or continent wiped out. It would be, you know, people would, would, would really, uh, it would resonate, obviously, a lot with people. So it's, you know, for me and for us, it's, it's a play on numbers, but also it speaks to the global burden. How are you working with the team going well? Yeah, it's going well. I mean, it's, uh, it's still a relatively new group, and it's a diverse group, but everything's good. Strong team. How do you go with that? A new group? Is it, do you find it hard to gel? No, I mean, the staff is all the same. A lot of the riders are the same, so that helps. And, you know, basically, the new place is still the same. Lance, I understand a mate of yours said you were on the pathway not that long ago. How much does that drive you and inspire you now to come back? Well, there's, you know, there's a lot of, a lot of, Unfortunately, a lot of stories like that uh, could be, uh, you know, an acquaintance like Jim was, or an ally like Jim was, and ended up with a lot of foundation with that stuff in the U.S. But uh, at the same time, there, there are stories that, that, that they just come through uh, the web, or the phone calls, or general conversation, people you don't know, but, but you see the fact that it has with a family, and a loved one. You know, that's the truth of the disease. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't discriminate. It doesn't care. One two seven four. One two seven four. And then uh, I think it's on the other side. There's one two seven four. And then where's the other number? Oh, twenty seven point five. That's where we have to re refocus our efforts. Yeah, thank you. On the frame. Yeah, yeah. I'm sick of but honestly, I'm sick of hearing stories like that. I love them. Sorry. Think about other things, but it's. Yeah, they were they were uh, it's a good group. Not only the kids but the parents and the kids and the, the doctors and nurses and the administrators of the way there. Yeah, for me it's an unofficial visit. It's not anything that, that I wanna a bunch of media too. I'd rather just go by myself. And, you know, kids are always interested in that kind of situation. Adults lay around and have a lot of self pity and they have no energy. Whereas kids, kids simply want to you know, survive and play another game. So it's all about. It.